two dozen of those jumbo jet burgers. Yeah? Well, I'm gonna have three dozen and a gallon of bubblegum fudge ice cream. I'm eating four dozen and triple chili fries with biscuits and gravy. I don't know about this. We'll be eating crow if we run into a patrol car on a donut break. You can't back out now. I'm so hungry, I could eat a, a dashboard. Mmm. All right, all right. Hangar 5 Hash House, here we come. Feeling frenzy. Sorry, bros, but I smell sea bits. Eh, me too. What would Dr. Sliminoid's guys want at the airport anyhow? Well, I don't know, but those middle brains will be taking a long flight if I see them. Lena said the physics department was air freighting a sample of stable antimatter to NASA today. If Piranoid gets his claws on that, he could fry the whole world. Whoa, dial in on this, bros. Those bottom feeders are pretending they're us. Let's all thin, guys. Shark attack! Piranoid didn't tell us the sharks would be at the airport. Now that people know it wasn't them that stole the antimatter, maybe we can take off these disgusting masks. Forget it. Dr. Piranoid would deep fry our DNA in ooze oil. Ready, Louis, and this time those showboating sharks had better not try to interfere. Let me at him. Just say the word, boss. I like your spirit, Louis, but I think the job may require something a trifle bigger, like one of those ten-ton dinosaurs from the Jurassic era, or maybe several. Screwdriver! With my new time machine, I can plunder the Earth's past for new or should I say, old creatures to biogenetically engineer. Ooh, that sounds dangerous. It will be, Louis. It will be. For anyone who tries to stand in my way, in moments, my Seviates will arrive with this stable antimatter. And once I insert it into the chrono refractor, I'll be ready to slam time itself. <laughs> Those cops are too close for comfort. Look, there's a utility company transformer station. I think it's time to give our pursuers a charge. Don't you? Yeah. <laughs> It'll be a blast. Spins up, bros! Yeah, it's shark jump time! <laughs> yeah! Seafood salad to go. Time to split up, reptile. Uh -oh. Which hand has the anti-matter? Jab, you and Streaks go after Kilimari. We'll take reptile. What is the anti-matter? What a day. At last, with this, my time machine is complete. A big day, forearms. Have a little shock trouble. More than even you can handle, Macho Mari. How'd you guess, you craven little crayfish? I ought to make Cajun popcorn out of you. Silence! Cease your petty bickering. This is an historic moment. Excellent! It's booting up! Wait, the lungfish, what's that? That's the crustacean creep. It's the time machine's time vortex. Once I select a time period on this dial, anything thrust into the vortex travels to that distant past. Shark alert! I thought I lost them. Move, move, squid lips. Ah, what I call it fortuitous. Now the street sharks can be the first to try out my time machine. Ugh, I smell a seaweed. Let's get him! Well, hold it, bro. At the risk of sounding like the ripster, we gotta exercise caution. Wrong. We gotta get NASA's antimatter back. Well, I agree, but... You can exercise all the caution you want. I'm going in. I'll uh, beg that. I'm telling you, we gotta have a strategy. I got all the strategy I need right here. 
It's fin kicking time! Uh, who's gonna cover your fin? Whoops. How nice of you to call. Do come in. You're just in time. I want that antimatter, Prunoid. Sorry. I'm afraid that would interfere with my plans for world conquest and better living through genetic alteration. Huh? Whoa! Strange! Him. You can start your search in, say, 10,000 BC. No! Uh, ah! uh! Yeah! Salt water? Well, where am I? Whoa, Veggie City. How's a dude supposed to skate without concrete? Oh man, talk about the sticks. I gotta find a place I can get a couple of burgers and make a phone call. Uh, quit biting me, would ya? No two ways about it. This place could use some major gardening help. And I'm just the shark to do it. Huh? Whoa! Whoa. Inches away from Banana Splitsville. Can't wait to see the chopped nuts and cherry. What? Whoa! I was kidding! Shark guy! Trust that gecko, Dr. Geekazoid, to gum me up for good. Man, I bet it takes me hours to swim back to Fish and City. Hmm. Shoot. Once I figure out which way land is. Oh, man, this wouldn't have happened if Streaks and I had gone in together. <laughs> Like Paranoid's really gonna send me back to 10,000 BC. Uh, bitch me, I'm dreaming. Ow! Uh, let me just. Uh, I'm out of here. I can't believe that battery powered bonehead reptile got away. We gotta find Jab and Streaks. The kid is right. Let's go. I don't like the looks of this, fellas. Yeah, the guys wouldn't leave the shark cruiser just sitting there. Everybody must have gotten into this 16-wheeler and gone. Somewhere. Yeah, but where? Where are our bros? That giant, giant mantis, mantis must, must be gone, gone by now. Hope it's friendly, whatever it is. <laughs> Whew. Huh, I'm safe now. No! Uh, uh, dudes, where are you taking me? Man, that dinosaur was as stupid as it was big. Shut up, stomach. Whoa, scope it out. Soy some mundo, dude. Where there's chickens, there's eggs. It's omelet time. <laughs> The shark's 150 million years in the past, Doctor. You'll never find it. Ha! 
Nothing could be easier. Travel through time disturbs the dimensional fabric along the axis of temporal disruption. I knew that. Quiet, kill Jumbo Jaw. Stop it, you bully. Would you two like to follow our shark friend into the Jurassic era? <gasps> there, the sparkling blue line is the time trail left by young streaks. All we have to do is follow it. <laughs> That's precisely what I wanted to see. Not only does the time machine work, but Streaks is in big trouble. I must say, these primitive Jurassic creatures really know how to handle a street shark. That thing's bigger than we are. It's a lot bigger than we are. Precisely the point. Their sheer mass, plus my genetic alterations, will create the perfect, indestructible, gene-slammed weapon. Say, you wouldn't get rid of us, would you, boss? That wouldn't be fair. Not if you improve your behavior. Like they say, get your genes together. <laughs> Talk about scaly, man. Well, maybe the old dweebazoid really did send me 10,000 years into the past. I'll never get to see my bros again. Well, I'll never get to hammer those dismal seviots again. And Streaks will never know how much I miss him. Even if it is all his fault, I'm stuck inside this merman factory. Cheer up, Street Shark. Huh? What? Where? I am Lyra, Chief Science Supervisor of Atlantis. Atlantis? Uh, well, pleased to meet you, uh, Myra. Well, my name's... <laughs> Your name's Jab, and you were once a young human named Bolton, and you have been betrayed by Dr. Paranoid, a man who was a disgrace to science. <gasps> Whoa! Totally Jossum! You can read minds, too! Only if they're friendly. Our civilization is an ancient and heavy one, Jab, but now... Disgust of Mundo. That dude reminds me of someone I used to know. He is a Neptunian, and his people have sworn to destroy Atlantis so that they can rule the oceans. Our soldiers thought you were a Neptunian spy. Oh, not me. No way. I don't even come from this time. I know. Our scientists have been experimenting with time travel. Perhaps we can help you. All right. Fantastic. Come, Jab. I will take you to... <gasps> oh, no! Neptunians are attacking! I don't care how many million years it takes me. Someday, I'm gonna get back to Fission City and thump Dr. Fish Lips into jellyfish paste. Check it out. I better jet before Mama brings the kids back for dinner. I have a feeling that dinner is me. I would have thought I would invent the first hang glider. Here goes nothing. Shark glide! All right! Whoa! Ugh. You'd think you'd never saw a flying street shark before. Just call me Streakosaurus Rex, king of the Jurassic. Huh? <gasps> Like, don't you know that violence never solves anything? You want to be king? It's yours! Here's the plan. Kilimari and I will set the trap. Reptile, your job is to lure the rest of those sharks into the time vortex. What do you want me to do, boss? Something real important, huh? You? You can be the bait. <laughs> <laughs> There you are, you slimy Slytherin snake. Come to Papa. Catch me if you can, Street Shark! Hold on to your fin, Slamu. 
It's gonna be a tight squeeze! If Reptile went in here, the Pranoid's probably in there too. And maybe jabbing streaks. I smell a trap. Trap or not, we gotta try. Our bros are in trouble. I can feel it. Okay, but let's take it slow. Oh, don't worry. This is what I do best. Be careful. Oh, you bet I will. I got a bro out there that needs my help as soon as I get done kicking some Neptunian fin. such a good time since streaks and and I you miss him I know come I'm going to help you find your brother and get home yes looks like the only way out of here is up those stairs over there smells like someone's trying to hurt us where they want us to go no one hurts me I hear you so why go up when they can come down know what I mean I sure do come on rip Shark Quake! Yahoo! We're bringing down the house! You cartilaginous creeps! You, you... <laughs> let me at him! Just let me at him! <laughs> you can skip the chit-chat, Barracuda Brett. Just tell us what you did with our bros. I sent them into the past, way into the past, before the dawn of time. What? what? My time machine's in there. And if it hasn't already been destroyed by your reckless meddling, then allow me to remedy that situation. some tasty fast food meal, but obviously not fast enough. I gotta think martial arts, like using my opponent's own weight and strength against him. Ugh, so much for karate. I'm warning you, let go of me right now or I'll give you indigestion. It's awesome! A 3D time scanner! Those two bright lines are your time trails. Our machine will send you back to get your brother, then send you both back to the time you came from. All right, ready when you are. Goodbye, Jab. Uh, goodbye! Oh, it's there! Whoa! You really ought to floss more often. Time to improve! Ah! 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 We'll never find streaks and jab now. What are we gonna do? We're missing two bros. Huh? Whoa! <gasps> are we glad to see you? Not half as glad as we are. Uh, streaks, bro. I'm sorry. It was all my fault. I, I should have gone with you. Nah, I was the one that was wrong. If it hadn't been for you, I'd be Dinosaur Burger. Speaking of which, I figure a couple dozen Jumbo Jet Burgers will fix everything. Hanger Boss Hatch House, here we come! Those shark simpletons think they've seen the last of my time machine? The antimatter is the only component I can't duplicate, and it's safe and sound with me. I promise you, Street Sharks, your time will come!
Beat.